Uh, the girls are great. Otherwise, uh, this experience has been just amazing. Okay, I love cool. It. Michael, can you present yourself a little bit to our guys who are watching this? Well, my name is Michael. I'm 50 years old from Las Vegas. And uh, I've been first checking time? up on, uh, yeah, this first time at any of the tours. Okay. I did check up about two years ago. Okay. And, uh, but with the COVID, I mean, there's nothing you can do. Yeah. You're sitting at home a lot and checking things out. And you, um, you found us on YouTube or how did you find us? So. Um, I found out on the internet. Okay. Mm -hmm. And uh, on the internet, I, do, I like to do a lot of research. Okay. And so I did mm -hmm. a lot of research and there is a lot of bogus companies out there. Mm -hmm. And uh, so I did the research for people who want, don't want to do the research. I did the huge research and I found out this is the best company. And I saw the Oprah, I saw all those videos and mm -hmm. once I watched them all, uh, and I probably spent hours watching all kinds of YouTube videos with John. So I did a, quite a research. Okay. That's good. Um, and then uh, I was waiting for John to have a seminar. Mm. Oh, you meant, okay. So when the John finally had a seminar in Las Vegas, I yes. went and saw John and his wife. Oh, cool. And, uh, and I talked to them and the, basically John convinced me to, to do this. Medellin opened up with no nothing, no, no restrictions. restrictions. Yes, and so I was like, you know, I'm gonna come to Medellin and check it out. And so far, I've been here, it's been amazing. Ah, oh, that's great. Uh, the girls are great. Okay. Every date that I gone, okay, except for one date. So <laughs> nothing's perfect. <laughs> it can happen. Uh, yes. But uh, <laughs> all the dates I've been to, they've all been great. Ladies are amazing. Uh, they they are affectionate, so mm -hmm. that's something that you have to kind of get used to. It's true. It's not like as if they're just liking you, but they are just affectionate. Mm -hmm. And so you gotta have to figure that out. But otherwise, uh, this experience has been just amazing. Okay, cool. Yeah. So you didn't expect, like, you had not really so much expectation in Colombia, it was just looking like a vacation place where to go. Exactly. And then, okay, that's exactly. good. So from the dates you have been so far, there was like already one or two girls you really liked, right? Yes. I okay. already got three girls that I really like. Okay. Now it's got to think in my head like who I really want to choose, but I'm like, maybe I'll just... Time will tell, you know? Time will tell. Time will tell. Yeah. So that's, that's good that you'd say it. Maybe a little advice there, guys. Sometimes that happens when you're on the tour and you meet a couple of girls and sometimes like the, the biggest problem often is that you don't know who to choose and i'd say it's a great problem always to have but i understand that because sometimes you're in bed and you don't really know the the advice will be just really time will tell you have to take keep in touch with all of them ride with them see how you feel when you go back who keeps communication with you who writes you in the morning who you would like to write you who are you missing who is she missing and if you feel that they're from those three there's always one standing out where you have more communication with and you just get a better feeling you will see in a month in two months um, really who will be the one it doesn't have to be in the tour that sometimes you also think you have to take a decision in the tour it doesn't have to be you just get to know each other right now. So it will take some time and time will tell and you will feel after a while with who you really would like to keep on moving to the next step or start a relationship or whatever. Right. And so you actually decided to extend your stay, you changed your flight, I you did. changed your hotel because of a girl, right? Yes, so, uh, yes I met thing. this uh, lady that I was very interested in, mm -hmm. and but she had to go some uh, out of town yeah. for a few days, and she had to come back on the day that I was leaving, yes. and so I wanted to at least to get a, another date. And uh, so I had to extend it just so, so I get a date with her to well, see how it will go. But that's yeah. great. Like if you can be so flexible and when things like that come up and you say, hey, I would like to 
really invest more time in that one because I had this special connection. Somebody said yesterday, you already spent the three or four thousand dollars to come here. So what is the hundred dollars to change your flight and to stay a little bit longer uh, and to really make use of your time while you are here? Because who knows when you're going to be back? Do you have a plan to come back to Colombia already or not sure? Um, well, if I do find a lady, mm -hmm. uh, I will be coming back without the agency probably mm -hmm. to come and see her, mm -hmm. which of which the cost will be a lot cheaper so then. Of course, because you uh, just pay the flight. Right, and pay the flight yeah. and... Then take care of the right, Airbnb whatever. or hotel or right. whatever, yes. And so, but I'll help. this trip was great. I would do that again. Yeah, that's great. You know? So yeah, yeah, I don't know what's going to happen in the next year, but uh, if, the, if the three girls that I like doesn't work out at all, uh, then I would like to try it somewhere else, mm -hmm. you know. You too can experience the romantic adventure of a lifetime. Join men from all over the world as they take a trip and find their future brides. Interested? Learn more at medianwomen.com. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Then click on the notice bell to get notified every time we add something new. Thank <laughs> you.